Welcome to the Quick Galloper YouTube channel. Please like, subscribe, share, and hit the notification bell. As they're coming into the lane and Chinese music still under the hand ride, looks to have something in reserve. The rider has a peep behind. He's catching a glimpse of Kingswood now cutting into that lead and now he becomes a busy man. It's Chinese music on the rail driven to the max. Here is Kingswood kicking in on the outside and Kingswood now snatches a slim advantage. Chinese music continues the fight. Musketoo needs to find three or more as Kingswood now begins to pull away inside the final 16. It is Kingswood coming away from the field in the first event. Kingswood and terrific Tevin Foster win by maybe five. Chinese Music second. Musketoon third. Master of Hall fourth. Mule Train is fifth. As they come towards the two and a half furlong pole, it's Jaguar still in front with a good looking lead about five lengths in front of Princess Sylvia. Prissy's right there coming on on the outside. That's great, Wayne, but it is Jaguar in front coming to the furlong and a half pole with a good looking lead. It's Jaguar in front right against the rail and coming on now. That is great, Wayne, also trying to come on too. That's Princess Sylvia. It's Jaguar coming to the furlong pole and with Jaguar in front switching off the rail, but Jaguar still in front. Great, Wayne begins to come forward nicely jaguar tying up a bit but here comes great win on the powerhouse handling it's jaguar great win and now great win and the bustling field parchment gets the lead from jaguar race it back in second then comes a princess sylvia cut tie for fourth between a traditional lady and a pretty Several horses spread across the course as they come charging up toward us. Under the stands, that's Hunter's Ridge now, caught and overtaken by Undecided. Opka Humka is more toward the middle along with Reminiscent Bola, uh, just in behind those and now being put to that stick, that's Nez Pierce, as they travel up now toward the final furlong. Opka Humka under the stands. Here is Reminiscent Bola now throwing out a strong challenge and the action is here and now Reminiscent Bola uh, joins undecided who has now come through and undecided under the stand fence now has that lead from reminiscent bowler fiery path trying to close up on the far side undecided will get there to win it easily in the end fiery path looks to be second and goes on the ground then nez purse reminiscent bowler hunters ridge coming to the two and a half furlong pole and it is Wall Street Trader stretching this lead about four lengths in front of Fun Candon fight trying to fight back into second also coming on that's Fred the Great right against the rail and coming on that's Narblar also coming on too that's Christian Light but it is Wall Street Trader still in front Fun Candon begins to bear down on Wall Street Trader it's Wall Street Trader in front Fun Candon they're coming to the furlong pole they're locked in battle Wall Street Trader still with the lead from Fun Candon also coming on, that's Fred the Great, Wall Street Trader and Fun Candon, and now Fun Candon as, as gets the upper hand from Wall Street Trader. Fun Candon pulls off, and Fun Candon wins by about a length and a half. Wall Street Trader, good try in second. Then comes uh, Fred the Great and uh, Grecian Light backing forth. As they leave the 516th, Finney now begins a run on the outside. Double the cash is the one near the rail, but they're into the top of the lane. And it's still a wide open affair. Dimitri P down against the rail. Storm Boy just on the outside. Finney between horses. Glittering Magnum in the pink racing out wide. And the winner may just come from one of these as Finney now points and gets a narrow advantage. Dimitri P is battling down against the rail. It's Finney and Dimitri P now in a tussle for it. And now Finney goes on inside the final. 16. It is Finney beginning to open up over Dimitri P. And Finney will come away under Shane Richardson to win by maybe three lengths. Dimitri P is second, tight between Blitz Strike, Storm Boy between horses, and Smart Player on the rail.
They're coming at the uh, top of the lane. Rosetta kicks on that lead, about three lengths in front. Rocola right against the rail. Out wide, Icarus Slim and racing wide out of it. That is Captain Sparrow beginning to fly. It is still in front. Rosetta, Captain Sparrow beginning to take on wings. It's Captain Sparrow and Rosetta. They're coming to the half of furlong pole rope. It's Captain Sparrow now begins to go away. Rosetta is still stubborn, but Captain Sparrow begins to pull off. And Captain Sparrow goes on to win with the champion jockey, Rain Lewis. Captain Sparrow beat Rosetta. Then comes Brenda Boy, Rocola, and Indestructible. As they've left the quarter pole behind them. Speedy here is right against the stand fence. Oasis Jack kicking in in the center. And on the far side, it is Shayla V. These three spread right across the course. In behind them, Babla trying to cut into it. But Oasis Jack now shrugs them off. And Oasis Jack takes charge inside the final 16. Shayla V on the far side trying to close. But it's all in vain. Oasis Jack and terrific Tevin Foster. He has a triple. They win. Shayla V. Close between Acknowledge Me, Super Alex, and Justin behind them from Sheer to Ben. Savvy girl over on the far side, right there too. That's Ella Fortunado. Ertigal is right in the middle. Also traveling nicely, that City Hawk right there too. That here comes a Fly Blue Jet and Burning Valor. They're still spread across the track. It's anybody race coming to the furlong pole. It is Burning Valor and Fly Blue Jet right there too. That's Ertigal. Here comes California Gold. James is flying on the far side. It's California Gold. Now that hits the front. It's California Gold in front of James. California Gold beats James. Then comes a Burning Valid got tied for fourth between a Savvy Girl and a City Hawk. As they lead the three, all for love races toward the back with Regal and Royal and Sweet Majesty firmly planted at the back of the field, going nowhere. As the field comes thundering into the top of the lane, Mamma Mia kicks and is asked to slip away from them. This could be a crippling move. Get a Pepsi is down against the rail. Provocativa looks to have cried enough. Money Monster is running on the spot, but Mamma Mia, the speedy one, is speeding away from them. Arriving at the furlong pole, it is Mamma Mia out in front. And Osorio... Josue Osorio is destined to have his first win. If he lasts, Get a Pepsi is charging. Mamma Mia beats Get a Pepsi. All for Love is third. Sunny T and Chippy fourth. Money Monster is fifth. They're coming out of the shoot and into, inside the final furlong and a half. It's Bulletproof Coffee with that lead. Coalition trying to get to Bulletproof Coffee over on the far side. That's Manushi. It's Bulletproof Coffee leading them coming to the half of furlong pole. Bulletproof Coffee begins to pull away from these. And Bulletproof Coffee has put paid to this field. Bulletproof Coffee winning this by about five lengths. Second, Manushi. Then comes Brian Express. Simply sensational. Cut tight for fifth could be... The one horse that's uh, crucial Alexia and uh, charming sound going by together. Thank you for watching another video produced by the team from quickgallopjaya.com and its YouTube channel, The Quick Galloper. Please stay on the channel for other enlightening videos on those involved in local horse racing. Please like, subscribe, and press the notification bell.